Looking to take your Madden game to the next level while dominating kids in Weekend League? And learn high level schemes from some of the best Madden pros in the world? Make sure you check out Hot Route Tips and use code CHAOS for 10% off at checkout. What's up everybody, Chaos here. Not only do I have a great one for you today, I have a super important one for you today. For any of you who play Ultimate Team, I'm sure you guys have already seen we got Steve Young this weekend. Now Steve Young was a very fast NFL player. He was a fast quarterback. He's 81 speed in the game. But there's a lot more to that. I'm going to be showing you guys that today. He comes with the Escape Artist. Now what does the Escape Artist do? Not many of us exactly know. We know it makes the quarterback fast, but what exactly does it do? Well, I'm going to show you here today. Okay, so here's what we're going to be doing for our little experiment. We're basically creating an NFL combine, if you will. Essentially, we're going to be using five different quarterbacks, one with zero speed, one with zero speed in the Escape Artist, one with 99 speed, one with 81 speed in the Escape Artist, because that's what Steve Young is, and then one with 99 speed in the Escape Artist. We're going to be testing all five, and then we're going to be doing the exact same run. We're going to be running from one side of the numbers, right at the number line, all the way to the other side of the numbers. I didn't want to go from sideline to sideline because stamina is an issue in the game, and I didn't want stamina to bring the guy down and ruin their speed. So basically, we're going to be testing how fast each of them can get from one number to the other just to compare. So we'll be starting off with Ben Roethlisberger. He's our zero speed QB without escape artist or anything like that. He just has zero speed. And we use 88 agility and 88 excel for every quarterback in our, in our test because that way we keep that constant and we just focus on speed. So let's get into Ben Roethlisberger. All we're going to do here is spy the entire D-line, give us time to just uh, run across the field and see how fast he can do it, man. It's zero speed, so I expect him to take a long time. Let's get to the start of this number here, right about here. Perfect. I'm going to run to the other side. Three, two, one, go. And this guy is slow as, oh my gosh, this guy is slow. And time. So Ben ran it just over five seconds. I'm going to assume that's very, very slow. For our second test, we're going to be using Patrick Mahomes. Now we all know he has escape artists, but right now he has zero speed. So we kept the 88 agility and excel constant, but we're going to see what that escape artist can do to a zero speed QB to see how fast it makes him feel. So we're going to do the same exact thing here, just spy our guys across the D-line, give ourselves times to run across. All right, let's see, how, let's see how fast we can get across these numbers. Get in position here. All right, uh, right there, perfect. Three, two, one, go. Man, he feels fast. Oh my gosh, time. Now Mahomes, with the same speed, took over two seconds off his time from what Ben ran without Escape Artist. Same exact speeds though. For our third test, we're going to be using Tom Vick, oh, excuse me, Tom Brady, at 99 speed, 88 agility, 88 excel. So we've already tested our zero speed QB and our zero speed with Escape Artist. Now we're going to be testing 99 with no Escape Artist, right? So let's see how fast he goes across. Let's get in position here, and we're going to run across this field. All right, we're in the middle. And three, two, one, go. And time. We did it, boys. We found the big one. A zero speed QB with Escape Artist ran faster behind the line of scrimmage than a 99 speed QB did. Now, I'm going to assume that small margin was probably due to user error. Maybe I started the clock slightly off time, ended it slightly off time, whatever the case may be. So I'm going to assume they're, they're the exact same speed. That's crazy to me. An escape artist QB with zero speed is identical to a 99 speed QB when behind the line of scrimmage. For our fourth test, we're going to be using Deshaun Watson. Now he has escape artists, but he only has 81 speed. We kept the 88 and 88 for the agility and excel constant, but we're going to see what this 81 speed with escape artists can do compared to the 99 speed. So we're going to see how much of a boost it can make because he's 18 speed lower than the 99 speed quarterback. Let's see what happens. So we're going to do the same exact thing here. We're going to spy our D line. I'm going to try to get across this field. All right, we're in position. Three, two, one, go. Man, this guy's flying, dude. Time. And the findings go even deeper. Now we see an 81 speed QB with escape artist is faster than a 99 speed QB. That means 99 speed is not even the cap when you're behind the line of scrimmage. You can go even faster. So an 81 speed QB with escape artist took off a quarter of the time. 0.75 seconds out of three, that's 25% of the time. That's a lot when it's that short of a distance, and that's a big difference. So for our fifth and final test, we're gonna be using Deshaun Watson again, but now as you guys can see, he has 99 speed 
88 agility, 88 excel. Now, we're going to see how fast this dude moves. I don't even know. I haven't seen it yet. This is my first time seeing it as well. So I'm very curious how fast this guy can fly. So here we go. Let's get in our, get in our position. All right. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, buddy. Time. All right, guys. So for our final conclusions, it seems... When you get to about that 80 speed level, you're going to be about the max you can be because the 81 speed QB with the Skate Artist was about equal to the 99 speed QB with the Skate Artist. The times were slightly different, but again, likely due to user error. So pretty crazy conclusions today, man. A zero speed QB is just as fast as a 99 speed QB when they have a Skate Artist. And when you add a Skate Artist to just a above average speed QB, you become out of this world fast. So a Skate Artist... Very difficult to stop. As you guys can see, when you're running 99 speed behind the line of scrimmage, no wonder none of your D linemen can spy them or catch them or whatever the case may be. You're not going to be able to tackle these guys. They're just faster than you. So escape art is very tough to stop. I'm glad we were able to find and see all the differences that escape artist does when it comes to speed of the quarterback hope you guys enjoyed the video man i worked hard to try to lab this up kind of experiment with it i think it was a pretty legit experiment about the best you can do with all the tools that tools that i had offered to me but hope you guys enjoyed take it easy peace